what you see here is a landing page and you see it's a quite long one and it is created with a Gutenberg editor now the problem is that navigating between those blocks and moving those blocks are quite cumbersome for example here we see the structure but we cannot move any of those blocks using this one here if I want to move this row I have to drag it and scroll it and oh it's cumbersome or I can move it by pressing on this arrow here therefore I'm going to show you another method which is much easier and user-friendly take a look I open the sidebar choose, choose the row it is here and now I just drag it up here voila now you wanna know how to accomplish that I'm going to show it let's update it and go to the dashboard the only thing you need to do is go to plugins add new and search for block navigation now install it and activate it and you're done now go to the pages open up one of them and after you install it you see this icon here just click it and first things word first let's go to the settings there is only color scheme settings I like the light one more so I'm gonna enable it and now you'll see all the blocks you have inserted on your on the page for example if you click here this one here is already shown for you if you click here this one here is activated now in order to move those blocks just drag and drop and you see it is here or maybe you wanna put it here now it's here let's put it back where it belongs or if you want you can move block down like this or up like this another one you can choose move block to click it and now let's point the place you want to place it for example well let's put it here and as you see with a couple of clicks I just moved buttons from up to down let's move them back move block back to and let's put it here oops wrong place let's move down if there is anything I don't want on the page for example this row here I just click and remove block basically it is a similar solution you can find with the elementor only difference is that you cannot re rename the blocks with a meaningful name for example header block or testimonials or whatever you want to rename it otherwise it's a really great plugin which allows you to save so much time when managing uh, Gutenberg blocks hopefully this video was helpful if it was then press thumbs up and subscribe to this channel if you do so you will be the first one to be notified about new videos meanwhile take care